go to mysql.com then select downloads if you scroll down you would see mysql community edition click on this link then click on this link mysql community server click on this download link here if you scroll down you would see select operating system select mac os x then you have to download this dmg file click on this download button scroll down you would see this link click on this link you can see download has started I am going to stop this because I already downloaded this file let me go to downloads folder there you can see the DMG file which I downloaded double click on this file this would open a pop-up like this double click on this .pkg file then click on continue continue click on agree then click on install here you have to enter your system password then click on install software so here you have to copy this password this is the root password copy this then then open text editor and just paste that password here so we need this password to log into mysql console using root user ok close this window click on keep then close this pop-up window after that if you go to applications folder actually there you cannot see the mysql icon so what we need to do is we need to open spotlight and search for mysql then enter you can see mysql here enter that will open a pop-up window like this so using this button we can start and stop mysql server right now it's stopped let me start you need to enter your system password now you can see it's running mysql server instance is running so let me open terminal then I am going to log into mysql console user local mysql slash bin mysql then minus u root minus p enter so here we need to enter this password
see now we are inside mysql console now we can run mysql commands let me list all databases so i am getting error 1820 so in this case what we need to do is we need to run this command set password equal to password then give new password so after that we can execute the command so after that we can use new password to login this is a new password one two three four five see So if you simply type mysql it will not open because we need to set path path variable so for that what we can do is just copy this copy this path then here create a file called mysqls then paste that path here actually all mysql binaries are inside this directory user local mysql bin so we are going to export that path then after that just close this terminal then open it again then just type mysql minus u root minus p one two three four five c so this way we can install and configure mysql server in mac